Hello folks, welcome to another video and uh, yeah, I'm shooting this in uh, 4k by 60 I'm hoping that helps with the uh, when my hand is in the field of view the uh, you No, know, the project doesn't go all fuzzy and of course I'm using the uh, Microscope camera so that I can see because I got old eyes and I I really <laughs> can't see up close and uh, But for you guys, hopefully the camera is picking up uh, of course, I'm looking. I'm looking at the back of the camera, but I can't tell because it's, it's a little dinky. You know, I, I should be using my phone, which has you know a seven-inch screen, but then you got the seven-inch screen is in the way. Yeah. So today, and I guess before I get on to today's project, of course, I you know I'm I'm feeling good since I have two success. You know, I got the uh, the two uh, gig <laughs> gig fun, uh, the blue board and the red board, and they're both. Uh, yeah, this one, uh, you know, I've uh, I put some real small, uh, like one one copper thread on the negative and on the positive. You can see. I think the camera will pick it up, and uh, you know, connect up a battery to it. Put a charge to these diodes or capacitors, and uh, they and, and they now show a, a charge on them. And uh, that's just something that you want that you know if you want to play with. And yes, and you should do all those extra stuff on the other side. Let's see it now. This one is a small. I chose this because for the first, I guess, assembly video. It's a small uh, little, uh, I guess, a uh, sound meter. So the the louder the sound gets, the the uh, brighter the LEDs get and this looks pretty simple pretty straightforward and it's a very small you pour out so I should be able to get this done and in, uh, in about 30 minutes hopefully make sure my camera is uh oops upside down I gotta gotta flip it it does record but this camera has no mic so, so I think it has doesn't have a mic I don't think it yeah I should upgrade I should upgrade to one that has a mic there we go Let's see here okay now it's yeah and luckily the software uh, of course was I downloaded from the Play Store it wasn't the, it was one of the ones that they recommended but it wasn't you know, their stuff uh, this I got this one because it, it's actually a, a 2k you know, uh, microscope camera but again, it does record, but I don't think it has a mic. I've been trying to find a, uh, a microphone hole uh, so I can record a video. If I stick the camera in front of my uh, tablet, you guys can see what I'm saying. And of course, I can use the mic on the, maybe next time. Let's see here. Okay, that's the underside. Let's, top, let's get started. So. Okay, so all the stuff is on the side here. You don't know the cameras. Whoop. That's the notification. Yeah, because my tablet is on the network. <laughs> if I get email or something notification, you'll be hearing the ding dong. Let's see here, 10K, one, one, wow, one mil. 4.7K, yeah, and then also I got this set up for, for my uh, security camera. So there's a, a trip, like the dog going in the backyard. If it trips, I'll get the ding dong notification too. So let's do the easy one, which is the LEDs. Let's see here. Plus, right? Yep. Normally on LED. I use one of these reverse clamp. Did I get the correct? I should test this. I use these reverse tweezers to, to hold one leg and uh, of course got uh, the uh, 0.6 of the 0 0.6 size uh, leaded solder and of course you know uh, since, since we're on the subject of lead uh, you know of course lead paint is banned because kids will eat it animals will eat it uh, see 
But as for lead solder, you know, lead weights for fishing is still, uh, let me turn the, uh, turn the, my USB fan on. The microphone should pick it up. It's not very loud, luckily. Let's see here. Okay. Give it a few more seconds for it to uh, properly heat up. But as for circuit board, the complaint was that, uh, you know, all of the electronics, computers and electronics being thrown away, you know, the circuit boards all had lead solder in them. And that, uh, of course, people are like, hey, man, where did lead come from? <laughs> lead came from the ground, and we're putting lead back in the ground. And then they're complaining, well, oh, is, is the lead's going to go into the, into the underground water supply. And, of course, someone or a group of people decided to, you know, hey, guess what? We're going to take you up on that. We're going to actually do a check. Let's see, yeah. Heat up. See, I'm, I'm using the... Yeah, and, and using the camera does get a little... Getting used to... Because you're literally doing it like in third person. There we go. Not good. Uh, can't tell. Yeah, and I, and I don't like it straight down. I, I have a, a a hole that is more at an angle, and it gives you more of a 3D view. I think that's good enough. Yeah, let me. Take some of the solder off. There we go. Okay. Yeah, I can kind of see. See enough to. For some reason, the light is it's like really shiny here, but on the camera, there seems to be like a, a shadow or something cast onto the board. Temperature and okay. Whoop. Did I get it? Look at the camera. No clean. Which basically means it's just a really water, watery, a watered down version of solder. We're getting in the camera view. Here we go. There you go. That just cleans up the solder a bit. Okay, next one. Okay, well, let me pause it. Put the rest of the LEDs on, because you saw the LED, and uh, you know, it seemed okay. Okay, welcome back. So, yeah, so I got out my magnifying glass. And, uh, yeah, I got the camera shooting through it, so you basically see what I see. And, uh, it's probably a whole lot better looking. <laughs> I thought, you know, screw this, let me just try it and see how it looks. And, hey, you know, it doesn't look bad. I can actually still see. Around the camera. So I won't burn myself. Let's see here. This is probably a lot better looking, too. Yeah. I can probably go a lot quicker because before I was Okay, come on now. There we go. Yes, and the soldering doesn't have to be pretty. Okay. And yes, if you get your finger that close, <laughs> like I had it, um, yeah, you will feel the heat, especially if you're doing three in a row. But uh, I, I, I guess if, if you work with your hand and such, you know, and you got callus, if you're a mechanic, which I'm not.
Yeah, the magnifying glass is way better. So I might order a, uh, a USB camera with a microphone. That way, if I am doing these, I can at least can at least use it. But if this works, then well, then again, I got, I got the camera where I'm, so, I'm kind of like looking off to the side here through the. Uh, uh, luckily, this magnifying glass is, is like a, the, it's like three point. Let's say it was three point eight inches across, so it's almost four inches across. There you go. One transistor. And again, like I said, if you're allergic to lead. Or if you're just afraid that, uh, yeah, so much better with, <laughs> with this magnifying glass. And I hardly use that USB, USB, I should use it more the way I get used to it more. But with the magnifying glass, uh, uh, it, it, uh, it's, it's times five, yeah, that's all you really need. Especially if you're young and you got like good you know, young eyes, you can see down close. Okay. Come on now. <coughs> yeah, it's going much faster. Before I was just struggling 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 to see you know okay I kind of screwed up that one and that one oh, man. okay didn't put enough solder on these there we go Yeah, as long as you hold, and as long as you retouch, like what I'm doing, you don't really have to worry about uh, getting getting cold cold spots, or cold solder. Get the pin. Yeah, and I also have uh, a uh, you know no clean flux, uh, which I use the brush on, but that one is it's really messy. I use it mainly for cables and such. But a second, two seconds, all you really need. There you go. All right. Ah, right, don't. No, no, that's correct. Now we just got to put in the capacitors. Let's see here. I'll screw this up. So the positive, positive, this negative. Yes, and on these round capacitors, the uh, the negative is always the side that has like the the white. Like here's white with line, this one's white with the dot, that's the negative side. And this on the capacitor is the negative side, the side with the white and the black dash. But they were still nice enough to show it on the... Yeah, this is slipping, so let me use the clamp. Okay, come, we'll come back. And as you can see, as I speak, it's flashing to my voice. If, if, yeah, if I can keep the terminals from touching each other, the negative and positive here. Let me turn the fan on. No. No. So it's got to be... So it's got to be, I guess, music or something? Yeah, so I'm snapping my thumb. Okay. Yep. Let me... Yeah, I could bring out my phone. I guess my voice... Yeah, I guess if I talk loud enough, it will flash to my voice. But if I hit my uh, brass canister thing over here... Yeah, the one in the middle here is is kind of like a 